We've got our first escort mission. <laughs> Welcome everybody. My name's Mike B. This is Valheim. Uh, Woovy, Jordan, Banana, uh, he says he needs, oh boy. He needs a pickup. Oh gosh, I don't have any health. I don't have any health. I don't have any health. That. Nah. Oh gosh, boars. Okay, that's right. That's right. Okay, I should probably eat something. Uh, Wolvie has a whole lot of silver and he needs uh, somebody to escort him. He's uh, came down off the mountain and he doesn't have a way to... Uh, to do anything uh, to get it across the water. So, I told Michael to pick him up. Here's the TLDR, bottom right corner there. And we've got a small mission, a boat escort. Yep. So, uh, this, by the way, is full of uh, dark iron ore. We've been uh, uh, collecting some. We've defeated the fourth boss successfully. And now it's time to go. We just, we, I literally just wrapped up that last bar when he asked for help. Perfect timing. I want to put on some clothes. I don't want to necessarily go naked. Uh, so we'll take this, this, and this. Oop, and this. And then do, do, do. Uh, we just get rid of some of this food. I don't necessarily need all this food. And then he's got to be waiting for a minute. He's got, he said he's full of, of, uh, of silver. Let me see. So do you, you, you. Oops, not the coat. Oops, grab the wrong thing. Let's go and let it, okay, not that. Good. We'll go put that away. Oh, I forgot I have all this crap. Let me pick it up and put it away. <laughs> I'll get there. I'll get there. I'm pretty far anyways, but I have to actually boat over there and then boat back. So it's going to take a minute. Uh, let me see this uh, for that. And we'll actually bring our headlamp just because, just in case. Just, you know, a little bit of light. And here we go. So yeah, we successfully took down the boss like eight times, nine times, something like that. Um, we streamed the whole thing, obviously. And then the following day, oops, this is the wrong damn thing. Wrong, sorry, Wooby. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and then the next day we ended up doing a lot of networking troubleshooting uh, and we were very successful in uh, basically figuring out that the, let me go and put some, eat some food here. Um, one of the main problems we had was just a, a, a basically a mod, a mod that was supposed to square up your, uh, uh, your bandwidth so that way you can send and receive more packets. Uh, that was actually causing issues, more issues than it was solving. So, um, we ended up, uh, ditching that and going with a, well, basically ditching that and, uh, and that actually cleaned up a lot. Like, that actually straightened up a lot of, uh, of our networking issues. Now, it was still pretty laggy. Finding the boss was just a complete laggy mess. Like, it's basically, like, I'm not putting together a video or anything for it, like, to, re to release because it was bad. Um... But then we decided after we did like three hours of testing to go and try to summon the boss a few more times just to see what happens. And, um, let me see, just watch a giant red slime. Fuck, there he's insane. Black Forest. <laughs> yep. All we have is a tier two. Okay, let me let him know. Uh, on boat. On my way. Just chucking rocks at me or something. Uh, and we ended up summoning three, three at the same time, three bosses at the same time, three dragons. I should just, just to be clear, <laughs> it was a nightmare, absolute nightmare. Uh, but it was good. Uh, it was good. It was good TV. <laughs> it was, it's funny because summoning the three bosses was actually less, uh, less laggy by only a slight margin than having one boss uh, the day before when, when we had uh, gone after the boss. He's right across the water here, so it's a pretty short trip. That's why I volunteered. Now, the uh, fort, the wind is moving, by the way. Is it? Uh, am I moving? Okay, no, no, no. It was me. It was me. Just drifting a little bit. Um, so, the... Uh, what was I saying? It's late. <laughs> I had just just finished putting all that iron, uh, getting all that dark iron, dark iron uh, smelted, and I was just like, I think it's time for me to go to bed. And he's like, I need help. And it's like, I got you. I'll be there, Captain Savaho. There we go. Um, 
Yeah, so it was just slightly less laggy than having one, having three dragons. So that's pretty good. Uh, just having one dragon out was actually pretty, uh, was, was pretty, we could actually see everybody's arrows and everything, which we couldn't see before. It was almost like it was just blinking all over the place. It was, it was a huge mess, very disappointing. Um, but the second day, just kind of impromptu, we still got like seven people that hopped on. They were watching the stream and they're just like, fuck it, I'll just do the boss again. So we had people from all over the world again. Uh, and it, uh, <laughs> <laughs> and it was, um, I mean, it was success. Like, yeah, it was a total success. I mean, you know, it was still pretty laggy, but <laughs> but it's success overall. Never seen one before. Oozer. Oh man, I don't even know what he's talking about. Oozer. Oh, a slime, right? I don't think I've seen an Oozer. I've seen a red slime. Oh, giant slime. Oh, snap. Have I seen a giant slime? Was it split in two, maybe? Maybe I think of Terraria. Okay, we're approaching. Of course he's at the damn plains, but he's safe, so it should be pretty good. Let's go ahead and cut this down a little bit. Boy, it's really hard to see. I don't think this light's gonna do me any good. Yeah, oh, perfect. Look at this. FYI, I'm encumbered. Look at that. Let's go an ore out. <laughs> this place is crazy. Yeah, look at that. Dark forest meets swamp, meets plains, meets mountain. Uh-oh. I was just talking about how we fix some latency. <laughs> a little wibbly wobbly. You for lagging here. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and pop this open and then... There we go. So this buff gives us basically sick wind no matter what we're doing. No matter which direction we're facing on the boat. It's pretty crazy. It's just like just perfect wind. And that's we obviously we get this from the uh, the dragon boss. Oh shit, Modair buff. Oh yeah. Zoom. <laughs> uh. Ace went every time. Oh, I guess we're gonna run now too. <laughs> uh. I wonder how much uh, Silvery picked up. He said he was encumbered, so probably have to help him put it away. Yeah, the buffs are pretty good. Yeah, I'm interested in other games. Absolutely. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Tops here. So yeah, there's clearly still some hiccups um, with uh, the netcode, but I mean, like overall, it is definitely a massive improvement for me, anyways. <laughs> Especially when you're alone. <laughs> when you're alone, there's nobody around, of course. Uh, whoops, I'm missing my spot here. Shoot. He doesn't know that though. Watch the wind adjust. Or I guess it's never. Yeah, look at that swinging back around. God, that's amazing. What a cool buff. Okay, we'll pull this guy right up here. So we installed a Valheim Plus mod that um, lets you zoom out a little farther on the boat. Just slide this in here. Whoa. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> 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 this thing is tripping. Oh my gosh. Hey, it's still good though. Oh, he's using, he's using it. How funny. Whoa, okay. I wonder if Top still has that fucking mod. Do you still have that, uh, what is it called? Do you have, uh, a, what is it called? A bandwidth 
mod installed. I bet he probably does. He's gonna say no though. Oh, what the hell? I guess I didn't really have too much. There we go. Help a brother out. Modair buff, Eichther buff. Successful run. Yeah, I mean, even here, the, everything here loads a little bit quicker too, which is kind of nice. Like, very nice. We still have a couple more tests we want to do with the bandwidth, just to kind of see if we can open it up a little bit more. Um, but, you know, it's it's a lot of, like, restarting the server and all that stuff. So I don't necessarily want to... Yeah, I guess, I guess we got to do it, like, late at night. Like, right now, actually. I don't use those thingies. Oh, okay. Okay. Me hate mine. <laughs> Oh, I got the rest. Get in it, Wolfie. <laughs> Dropping a chest. That's not obviously not his ore chest. Whoa, son. Who the hell brought all this copper ore? Well, I'll put it there. There we go. Perfect. He said thanks. It's for the islands to put it wherever. Put it in the uh, ore box. This is a true documentary on Vikings. Goddamn top. <laughs> uh, Alright, back to doing what I was doing. Which is forging some new shit. Oh, you know what though? If you don't watch a stream, I'd like to show you what happened to the, uh, um, so Red, uh, Red and Blue is his name. He built a, come on, come on, come on, uh, he, oh, Red, what the, oh, I put me in the wrong one, dang it. Uh, he built a nice little, like, kind of stone fort, or sorry, yeah, stone fort, uh, at the top of the mountain near where the, um, oh, is it Red Trader? Uh, near where the fourth boss spawns. Um, and he got all these resources together to make the boss, you know, basically make it easier. Like he cross resist potions for those that need it, uh, and all that good stuff. Matter of fact, you can see some of his stuff in here next to his body, like frost resist potions, some health potions, all that good stuff. Um, and this is what's left because we summoned three dragons and it wrecked shit. Absolutely wrecked everything. Uh, there's so many clips of just crazy shit that happened. <laughs> uh, I should take the I at least should at least take the clips and try to cut them down into something. But yeah, oh, man, it was just mayhem, and it was only like five minutes of just of just you know doing stuff. Well, sorry, like probably like no, thirty minutes of uh, experimenting, just trying to get the networking down and all that stuff. And uh, it's just hilarious. What is Top saying? Let me see. Either for one ball or two ball, does the bus turn down the avenue? Or <laughs> This is what the hell is top. Top is just a fucking mess. <laughs> uh, this is my street. This is the, the beauty of uh, being on a multiplayer server is that, you know, uh, you're never alone. <laughs> There's always somebody that could, you know, spring a mission on you, spring something on you. I like the dirt road you got. Yeah, we're going to up that later. All right, back to the house. So I've been thinking about, and this is a strong maybe. Uh, I've been thinking about moving my house. Um, I don't necessarily want to build a whole new one, you know, but because of the way the, because of how much cleaner the game is whenever you're not near other people or other buildings, uh, like right now, as I'm here, I'm still rendering everything that's happening over there, right? So all the smoke and all that stuff that's happening, I'm still rendering that. Um, so it's taken a hit for me. Um, I kind of want to just, and we kind of joked about this, you know, uh, I think Next said that, uh, we could do it like Hawaii where we can have everybody would basically have like their own island kind of thing, you know, and an island, not, 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 uh, figuratively speaking, where like you could set up, like initially I was just here by myself and then Next and Top set up right here, which is fine, you know, um, but now we know that it's not fine because I'm rendering all that shit. Uh, and, and they too are rendering everything happening here. So I kind of want to go like set, set out a little bit further away from here 
uh, and just, you know, set up a new place somewhere. Oh, by the way, the map is fixed. Um, I reset the map and that ended up, uh, um, that ended up giving me, uh, oh yeah, we did the share map thing. So basically with Nex and Top and some of the other guys I normally like crew with whenever we're running around, uh, I had them share their maps with me and that was, that was perfect because this is all stuff that I had explored with them. So it worked out just absolutely perfectly. So yeah, um, I'm thinking of moving basically. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. I'm thinking of moving. Uh, let's see. Black Metal. What do I need? Black Metal. Black Metal Axe. I feel this Black Metal Axe is pretty good. I've been using Axe lately after the PvP session we had. It's been um, pretty handy. Black Metal Knife. Black Metal Shields. I mean, this is really what I should go for first. Fine Wood. How much stamina do I have? Plenty to walk around. Let me see. Black Metal Tower Shield. Blocks 105. And this does what? 90. That's base too, but this is a minus 20% movement. But what's going to get through that? I mean, it looks sexy too, right? I get to stand there and just take the blows. It's like, whatever. Uh, what does mine block? 85. So base level is actually going to be better. Huh. Base level. But man, I really, I mean, like, what can I build with this? Oh, God, these look sick. Damn, like, why wouldn't I just build a big one? That's only 10. Oh, my God, it's only 10. Yeah, we're building one of those. The chains. Uh-oh, oh, chains might be a problem. Oh, I have 12 chains. Okay, cool. We're gonna build that right now. Oh, wait, I need more than that, though. I uh, need to have... What else to see? Uh, black metal tower. Firewood. Some firewood! Some of your finest wood right over here. Huh? I thought I had more than that. Son of a bitch. I thought I had more. Hold on. Damn. Did I make something? I don't know. Maybe I did. Uh, but I can make my shield now. I mean, I can make a reasonable shield, but I'm not that kind of person. Uh, perfect. We'll make this. Oh, shit. Did I make the base model? Oh, shit. You know what, though? This one did look kind of sick, so maybe I'm okay with that. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at this big... Big metal black iron. I mean, it's not very black. It's kind of shiny. All chromed out. I always do that. I always make like one that's like base level. This is like normal. And then later I come back and I make another one. So we'll support this for a little bit. Oh, I'm still like sweating. <laughs> so, my poor guys is like, oh God, please. <laughs> let's go ahead and empty some stuff out here. Um, let's see. Uh, I got nothing else I could really throw in here. Damn, I got so much crap. Let's go and go over here. We'll get rid of some of these berries. And then put them in the berry box. Boop, boop. Stole these from Woovy. That was part of his payment. <laughs> his payment to me. Alright, we'll put them in here. This box. I don't have any. doesn't really have a home. This box was gifted to me. Next, hook me up. So if I save, I bust this out. Let's see. Boom, boom. Oh, yeah. There's a, I mean, there's a speed decrease. But you know what, though? Like, for what it does? Yeah, man. I mean, I wish I could see myself in this. Like, turn the camera around or something. Selfie mode. Let's see. So let's go ahead and put this shield away. This is, If I need an agile shield for some reason, I'll come back for that guy. Uh, but I think this is good for now. So let me plot my next my next trip because obviously I need more stuff. I'm going to build some of this, right? Let me see. This thing is pretty dope. I've not used one of these before. That might be kind of cool. So I need fine wood and linen thread. Uh, I don't think I have any skill on this, as a matter of fact. Yeah, pole arms. Zero. It looks sexy. Um, I'm more of a sword and board guy, but, um, but still, I mean, it looks, it looks really sexy. So, you know, black metal axe. Yeah. Yeah. I was told this was very expensive to, to build and then upgrade a bunch of times. Um, let me see black metal tower power shield. Some more fine, fine wood, lots of fine wood, huh? So fine wood, that's going to be the, uh, that's the theme here. What is he saying? Looks weird. Oh, can you make a good rug PvP video? I don't know what the, <laughs> what the fuck? I wish I ever lowered <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> I don't know. How do I respond? <laughs> I'll just say that. <laughs> I don't know how to respond. So I need... Oh, you know what? Yeah, I need fine wood. Mm, and fine wood is mostly more easily found in the plains. Hmm, we might be going to the plains. 
Okay, I'm gonna close that door on me. Notice how the door is open and closed so so easy now? That's because networking's better. <laughs> Seriously, it's because of that. Let's see. So let's go ahead and put this, this, this on. We'll take our big boy with us. Don't need this. The light. The light is so useless. There's a mod to make it a little bit better. I might actually just invest in that. Invest. You know, install that. Let's see. Enough food to get there. Get back alive. All we're going for is fine wood. There's lots of, I think, birch trees in um, the plains. And there's a plains really close to um, where we're about to go here. So let me see. For the chain. I know I kind of made a mess already. There's so much crap in here. We'll put it in here. Got stupid eyes in there. Those, those could have come out. Uh, we'll go and take that. Just kind of leave it on slot. And then I've been rolling. I've seriously been rolling with the... Uh, wooden arrows lately and it's been really good to me damn wooden arrows are like it's most of the powers in the bow so the wooden arrows have just been just just penetrating <laughs> just doing so good all right let's see it's honey pop any for breakfast video together uh, this man's crazy i mean there is something in the pipeline <laughs> that's not too far from that, which is probably what he's referring to. Okay, all of these gotta go. So let's go ahead and just get started with this guy. All of these. There you go. Some fine, some of the finest wood. There's regular ass wood in there too, eating up space. We'll chop whatever ones we see on the way there. Did I pass one? Maybe. Oh, dang. Yeah. Gotta remember that. <clears throat> Manage my stamina. It's amazing how many hours you put into this game. How easily you could put this many hours into this game, you know? We're gonna walk. <laughs> How much fine would I have right now? 32. Yeah, we need to get some stacks. Like stacks of... Like stacks of this. Of fine wood. Do these bases, do stumps ever give you fine wood? I swear I never get fine wood out of these guys. I swear I never miss these things so many times. Yeah, regular wood. I swear every time. I think tops smoking the reefer. Alright, so apparently these, are these the trees I give it to you? I mean, what the heck, I guess, uh, let me see. Wood, wood, oh great, nice, it's exactly what I need right now. But I'm told, according to Reddit, somebody made a comment about that there's not a way they wanted to re- Replant. Ah, oh, yeah, here we go, bitch. Oh, damn. Of course, I missed the first one. Come here. Come on. We gotta test this guy out. I mean, I already know. I'll block it, but I just want to see it. Hurry up. Bonk. <laughs> damn, it feels good to be a gangster. Oh, look at all these trees. Oh, snap. Okay, wow, they weren't kidding. Okay, awesome. We'll leave the shield on, though. <laughs> We will leave this on. Oh, look, we got a gobble coming. Got a bruiser coming. Let's save some of my stamina real quick. Oh, a little bit of leg. Give him a couple of knocks. 140 hits four. Let's let him, let's let him get a good swing. Like, yeah, it doesn't even stand a chance. Oh, dang, I almost messed that up. So he's gonna drop Dark Iron and... <clears throat> which I can't take back with me. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna leave it here. It's unfortunate, but it's the way it is. We have, I mean, obviously we have some chests over there. I can just leave it there, it's fine. Oh yeah, we're gonna get tons of fine wood here. Tons. Look how slow I walk, though. Hmm. Yeah, I guess it is pretty slow when you have this thing out, but... Here's what we'll do. Just kind of... S just gently speed this up. 
because I want to fill up my bags. What I'll do is I'll pocket it, and then that'll give me a little bit more speed, just tiniest little bit of speed, and then R to pull up everything back out again. In case you didn't know, R will sheath your current weapons, and then you R again, and it'll pull out the last weapons that you had available. Just so you know. There's a little village over there. Planes are so pretty, though. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh yeah, there you go. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it the old-fashioned way. Ooh, ah, just let another tree do the job. Oh, look at all these cloud berries. Son of a... I'm gonna need those. Let's see. Uh, I do have enough to put down... Nope. No, not a bed. <laughs> Odd choice. There we go. So let's go ahead and get... There we go. And then we'll pull this back out again. Boom. Try to get a good swing. Get everything in here. Both. Whoa! That's gonna go take out a tree, right? Oh, it's gonna go in the water. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, it stopped. Good. What do we got? Oh, we got a little posse here. Oh, we got a pile. Oh, an actual posse. Let's see if we can take out one real quick. Great fire. Wooden arrows, I'm telling you. There was another one here, I swear. Maybe not. Okay. I thought there was another one here. Okay. Yeah, wooden arrows. Don't waste don't waste your resources, guys. Wooden arrows will do the job. And do it well. Oh crap, I'm beating up the cloudberries. Damn. Get away, get away, get away. Pick up what's left. Gosh, I ruined so many. This is a healthy run. I like this. Healthy run, much like I'm trying to do with this big ass shield. <laughs> it's worth, you know, it's worth it though. Like, if I gotta wear, if I gotta wear this big ass shield and carry it around with me, like hella slow like this, I'm, I'm, it's totally worth it. Absolutely. Let's look like a boss is walking around. Yo, you know that's minus twenty percent. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> oh, I'm getting pretty close to filling up here. Uh, let's see. Let's just go and chuck that. Oh, you. My froster would probably wreck this dude just a couple of hits, but I mean, I'll take the axe. It works. There's the other one. The other one left down at the bottom. It's amazing how we go from one episode where I'm fearing going anywhere near the planes. Hold up. I'm going anywhere near the planes to just like moving out to the planes because I can. Just like marching around. I'm I'm still in uh silver gear, by the way. It's the same gear I had before. Um Oh. Okay, okay. Oh arrow. They sound like Ewoks. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Get out of here. Whoa. This guy has a spear. Yeah, he is. Yeah, dudes. Y'all ain't got nothing on this. Whoa. I'm not trying to fight a lox right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to hunt for fine wood. That's all I need. Some fine wood. Let me see where we at. Uh, two or one hundred. One hundred fine wood. That should be enough to get going. Let's go ahead and head back. We'll kind of keep a nice little jog here. I know I got that one I left down there, but that's fine. Do I have exactly that? Yeah, I do. Look at that. Exactly a hundred. That was meant to be. It was meant to be. We'll ride along this because I don't necessarily want to get in too much, too much of a skerfuffle with anyone. I got a gobbo head though. Cool. I didn't bring my light. Of course I did not. Didn't need it. Still don't believe I need it. So we'll take this back. We'll drop off the dark iron at the the base here and 
now we have a shit ton of uh a fine wood to work with i would have done it around the base but there's just so so many trees that we've already just like taken down like there's just hardly it's hard to find any i end up, end up running around the meadows forever to try to find you know maybe a handful and here wow they weren't kidding like there really is a lot of uh birch trees here so that's what we'll do we'll just keep coming back i didn't realize i went this far holy crap where am i there i am okay oh i went past the house okay <laughs> oh yeah i did not go this far actually <laughs> I didn't go this far at all. Just not paying attention. Watch this, watch this. Okay, I tried. 360, no scope. Yeah, uh, so I had got my bow uh, skill up pretty high. You could tell by how quickly this thing will knock, right? Like that. Um, but... We died a handful of times, so I ended up like knocking it back a little bit. So I think I'm at probably like 90 or something, but I mean, it's still super fast. Like once you, I think I was at 90, um, 93, 94, because we had, we had expended like, fuck, so many, like so, so many, um, arrows during our fights, our, our eight fights with the, uh, with the boss and um with the dragon boss and so like i gained like four or five levels just doing that is and then i lost it like just dying once <laughs> or twice or something like that but i think it was just once i don't die that much <laughs> so let's see let's go and get this stuff in hand what can i make craft still can't make nothing oh because i need linen that's right I just put a handful of things in my- I just put a bunch of shit in my hand. There you go. That's- that's how you do it. You just put a bunch of crap in your hand and then you go and look to see what you can make. Hmm, let me see. So I definitely want to have a new axe. Slash, let's see, what is the slash? Slash is 70. Oh man, yeah, that's pretty good. Um, let me see. I, I eventually want to make something like this, but right now I'll focus on just the things that are, you know, important. Go to these. And let's see what I can upgrade. New item, black metal axe. Yeah, we'll upgrade this thing. And oh, what does it want now? Uh, oh, level six. Oh, snap. A forge level six. I don't have a forge level six. I think next might. So I probably go over there and uh, and finish the job here. Um, what does it need? Just uh, it needs 20. OK, I'll be a bitch to haul over there. But, you know, I'll do that later. Um, and then let me see. Is there anything else I can pick up and, buy and, and make? I mean, people say the sword is amazing, but I think what, what I want, I want this thing. Uh, where is it at? The porcu something, a porcupine. This thing just looks amazing. It's one-handed mace or something. Um, let me see. Blunt 50. Yeah, it's a, it's a mace. Blunt 50. Pierce 45. I mean, is it that good? Hold on. This thing is slash 100. I mean, it's two different types of damage, but still, it might just be worth it just to have. Deadly weapon bristling with fiendish spikes. It just looks so good. Needles. I could farm them. Oh, I have a bunch of needles already. Yeah, the iron is the only thing I'm missing for this one. But we got tons of fine wood, so we're set. We're set to build basically whatever we want. Um, it's just a matter of just getting the resources to where they need to be in order to forge it, right? Um, to make a tanker or a torch. Hey, a torch. Look at that. Put the, we'll put the head away. Gobble head away. Gosh, somebody out there banging on the damn door. We said it was like a doorbell. It was the perfect. It was the perfect. Yeah, it was like it's exactly it. It's like a doorbell when they come out. They just knock on the on the wall. Doom doom. Whole thing resonates. You see, cloud block, lots of cloud berries, lots of bacon and stuff that's gonna go on. Yeah, this is the artisan table. You craft this out of re materials that you uh, get from your um, or get from the fourth boss. And then we're gonna drop this in here, and then we're done. Hey, what an eventful day! A little bit of uh, a little bit of escort mission, a little bit of uh, chopping some trees in the plains. Pretty good, pretty good. The fog was dense. It looked good though. Sweeping in there for the save. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of your night or day, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.